Hi everyone, welcome to the Sanders household. I am giving our Monday memo from Mason Assembly of God. And so I just wanted to touch base with everyone. Uh, we missed you on Sunday, but thank you for all that tuned in to uh, church on Sunday um, via all the different avenues we have provided. Um, we love you all and we are praying with you. I just have a few things that I want to say to update you on and uh, just remind you of. And I have it on my phone here, so I don't forget anything. So um, this Wednesday and the Wednesdays in the future, we'll be posting a combined devotional for adults and youth, and then a separate kids video available on all of our platforms, YouTube, website, and Facebook. Um, I think Pastor Matt's trying to get something um, cooked up for the youth and um, adults, so um, that's looking to be pretty fun and exciting. So please connect with him if you are interested in being a part of that. Um, we will be providing a VBS preview for the summer. We're really hoping that um, the virus will be cleared up by then. We can still continue on with our VBS. So Pastor Andrew and I are going to cast a little vision and show you what we have planned for this year. It's going to be a lot of fun. And we will be posting a video for that on our Facebook and YouTube. And that will be on Friday nights of this week. If you are interested in helping um, with any of the different things that we talk about on that uh, during that video on Friday, please um, comment on the post or send us a text message or give us a call, and we can give you more information about it. And we'll mention that in the video as well. Um, we just have um, I have a lot of hope that we'll be able to really minister to these kids and. Um, uh, share the love of Jesus with them uh, during our summer months. Uh, women's ministry. I want you to save your favorite chocolate for our yummy event. We're going to kind of improvise and do a, a little small chocolate tasting over the internet here uh, on March 31st at 7 p.m. I'll be posting a video and doing a chocolate tasting with you. I guess men, you are welcome to join us. Um, it is our women's ministry event, but you can join us with your favorite chocolate. Um, make it a whole family thing if you like. But I'm going to really be targeting, um, just talking with my ladies, but you are all, everyone is welcome to join. That will be posted at 7 o'clock on our YouTube and Facebook. And, you know, one thing that we'll be learning best of all is um, that God is even better than our best chocolate that we happen to have on hand here. So I won't actually have my favorite chocolate. I'm trying to stay away from the store, but I will have a chocolate that I'm and still going to be able to enjoy and um, do the tasting with you for. Um, parents, we know that camp is the farthest thing from your mind, but information on that can be found on aogmi.org. You can find the different dates of the camps um, that we have chosen to uh, take our kids to. And those dates are on our online church calendar. You can find that at our website at www.masonag.org. Um, if you're interested at all, um, maybe even needing a scholarship or different things, we can talk to you about what those possibilities look like. Um, I know things are kind of up in the air, but please give me a call if you want to discuss um, camp options for your child. Um, Looks like uh, the church as a whole in, the, in uh, the United States and even the world broke Facebook on Sunday. Um, our children's church uh, service was a little glitchy on Facebook just because there was a ton of traffic going on right around 1030. And so what to combat that a little bit, we'll still go ahead and post Pastor Matt's sermon at, 10, at the normal 10 o'clock time. That seemed to go pretty smoothly. But we're going to go ahead and post the... Um, children's church service around 9:45 ish. Um, we'll let you know the specific times for those on uh, around Saturday. I'll send a text message out. But if you have any, um, if you if you aren't able to join us during that time, you can still catch the services afterwards on YouTube, on our website, and Facebook. Um, so you don't have to be there for the live part. Um, it's fun to live chat with those of you that can join us, but um, those can still be viewed after the fact of being posted. Um, just a really quick reminder, I want you guys to be praying for those affected by this virus. Um, many people are fighting for their lives. Um, 
there's actually a, a post that I just posted I shared from the Assemblies of God World Missions, a list of different leaders and missionaries that are um, fighting the effects of COVID-19. And then um, with the shelter in place being put in, people are out of work and different things. So just please be, please be in prayer for others for this time. Um, spend some extra time just seeking the Lord and saying, God, how can I help? How can I be a blessing? And um, he hears us. Please let us know if you have, um, if you need any assistance accessing any of our online services or the online giving. Um, our, plat our giving platform is limited to three causes. If you have a specific ministry you want to give towards that isn't listed, please choose the general fund and then leave a note with your donation. That option can be found at the very bottom of the giving platform. Um, if you'd rather not give online, Pastor Matt is gathering me mail from the church, and you are welcome to mail in your missions and your tithes giving. Um, most importantly, please give one of our pastors a call if you are in need of prayer or help with anything, and we'll see what we can do. We can definitely pray for you. We can talk with you if you're feeling lonely or just need someone to, to talk things over through with. Just, uh, just let us know. And last but not least... Don't forget to stay home if you can, and keep washing your hands. And remember from yesterday's sermon, the battle is the Lord's. He is with you, he loves you, and give it to him. He's got this, he's got our backs. Uh, thank you everyone for your input from yesterday's services, and let's keep being the great church um, group of people that I know Mason Assembly of God is. We love you all, and have a good day.